The Utah Flash came to Tulsa trying to sweep a weekend series after winning Friday night on Saturday, February 12th. They got some great outside shooting from Kevin Kruger, just returning from an injury. He led all scorers with 21 points, including this three-pointer. In fact, he was four of four from downtown. Andre Ingram also continued the three-point barrage, and after one period, Utah led by seven. In the second period, Jerome Dyson fed Latavius Williams back after an injury, closed Tulsa to within one. And then this block by Byron Mullins and Elijah Millsap taking advantage of it to give Tulsa the lead 43-42. But from that point forward, it was all Utah, including this buzzer beater at the end of the first half by Ryan Thompson to make it 50-47. In the third period, Larry Owens feeds Mullins for a basket and again Tulsa inches to within one. But after that, Utah went a 21-7 run, including Orion Green back from the nets with this basket. And then Inkum Ajubu was lights out in the third period. He had 11 points in the third period, and Utah went on to a big lead after Marcus Lewis closed it to 11. Thompson hit another basket at the end of three. They led by 15. Utah ended up winning going away, including another basket from Ajubu in the fourth period who finished with 19 points and 11 rebounds. And Tony Gaffney hit a three at the end of the game. Utah hit 10 overall in the game, and they beat Tulsa 113-95. For this action and much more, go to nba.com slash D-League for tickets and highlights.